hey how you doing welcome to or welcome back to money spent reviews this is chris back with another review this is the channel where i review things that i have purchased to possibly help you decide to make a purchase as well today i'm doing a review on the Vevor rolling garage stool okay very nice stool it has the pu leather and it has a racing style seat it also has a three-way parts tray and it is about 21 well 20 to 21 inches in diameter it also has a rail underneath it to where you can pull it if you're sitting down towards and closer to you or push it away very nice seat i'm going to spin it around here in a second uh, let me go through some of the rest of the specifications it has five inch caster wheels and they have wheel locks on them as well two of them do okay it's uh, rated for 21 inches to 26 inches in height up to 300 pounds maximum weight so uh, the three-way divider is a plus if you want to put you know certain tools in each way each tray or some bolts or screws or whatever you're working on at the time and it's a very nice diameter tray it was a uh, 114.99 at the time of purchase on Amazon so I picked one up I've had it about six to eight months I can't really specify so I'm just gonna give you a time frame but I keep it real nice I don't really do anything to tear it up but I do work with the chair and I just clean it off with a nice cleaning cloth or something like that sanitation cloth and wipe it off and use the chair once again just keep it nice so let me go over the chair uh, to it and spin it around so you can see it but it's a very excellent chair I recommend it I've had five of those old school style chairs over there that black one in the corner on your right I've had yeah about four or five of those and through time of course price fluctuation and everything but through time I think I've purchased yeah yeah five might as well just say five and probably spent about 150 dollars through those purchases uh through time so i went on and invested in this one because i liked it and it was like okay 300 pounds rated five inch caster wheels uh they do roll over extension cords uh rather well it says it's rated for three eighths uh air hoses as well too but i don't recommend you try it you know unless you just want to but it does roll over the cracks in your garage very nice and easy so let me move it around and let you see it and show you why i upgraded so um the black one over there i think i had three or four red and that is the black one and the reason why i don't like those seats it doesn't have a backrest and the wheels always fail so let me spin this around for you guys i also did a review on a similar chair of this one, which is made by Traxion. It's called the Traxion Pro Gear Rolling Seat. So check out that review. It is very similar to this chair, but it's a lot more expensive and it runs you a little bit more. So this one's 114, that one runs you about 172 to 176.99 on Amazon. So I'm just gonna raise it up, show you the height. That's the maximum height. Show you the back of the chair as well. Hopefully you get a good view. And you have a lot, I put my locks on different sides so it'll be stable when I lock it in place. That's up to you where you wanna set your wheels. They already have the locks on them, but um, I set them side of each other so they can lock in place and I don't have to worry about it sturdy or uh, not being sturdy, but it rolls over, it cracks very good even when you got weight on it. Very nice piston. But yeah, I like the chair, so I just want to do a quick review on this chair made by Bevor. And thanks for watching Money Spent Reviews. I hope you like it as well. If you work in your garage a lot or you do a lot of mechanical work uh, in your garage or just want a nice uh, stool to roll around in your garage, then I recommend you pick up one of these Bevors. So thanks for watching Money Spent Reviews. Please like and subscribe. Until next video, I'm out.